One of the things we need to get really good at is being able to switch between a log form and an exponential form. So in A, all of these are in exponential forms. And we can write the equivalent form as a logarithm. So 3 cubed is 27. If you wrote that as a logarithm, the base of the logarithm is same as the base of the exponent. That part is easy. Logarithms always solve for exponents, so when you go equals, what is on the right-hand side of the equals sign will be the exponent. The original exponent was 3, so log 3 of 27 equals 3. And I like to think when I see a logarithm, I like to put a little question mark there for me to say 3 to what exponent is 27. In B or II, we have 5 to the negative 2 equals 1 25th. So we would write this as a logarithm as log of base 5 of 1 25th, and the exponent is negative 2. So log 5 of 1 25th is equal to negative 2. And finally, part 3, 4 to the 0 equals 1. So if we wanted to write that as a logarithm, log base 4 of 1 equals 0. For part B, each of those are logarithms. Log 7 of 49 equals 2. Well, the base is 7, the exponent is 2, it's equal to 49. Part 2, the base is 4, the exponent is negative 3, it's equal to 1 over 64. And the last one, the base is 10, the exponent is negative 4, is equal to 1 over 10,000. And you're going to find that you're going to do what we did in part B a lot more than you're going to do what we did in part A. Because in part A, right, when you see 3 cubed equals 27, your brain probably goes, yeah, that looks familiar, that seems right, I feel good with that. Right? When you see log 3 of 27 equals 3, you're like, whoa, I haven't thought about logs that much yet. Uh, this is going to take me a little while to think about it. Because it's not like, oh, I see log 3 of 27, boom, in my head, I go, oh, yeah, that's 3 because you're not used to it yet. So more often, you're going to take logarithms, right? If someone said, log 749, quick, 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 you'd be like, whoa. But if someone said 7 squared, you'd be like, yeah, 49. I'm, I'm good at that. You'd be able to say that quick. This, not so quick yet, because you're not used to logarithms. So more often, you're going to be taking logarithms, using the definition and changing them to exponential functions, because that's what you're more comfortable with. And over time, you might be able to just say, oh yeah, that's 2. Log 749, that's equal to 2. OK, so try practice. Try these questions. Practice your changing from one form to the other.